Assalamualaikum and greetings to all lecturers and friends. We are from group 5, will present to you about torsional analysis. Our group member are Faris, Azman, Aidil and Arifin. The main objective of our experiment is to determine the stiffness value from the experiment data and to determine the decay rate for different mass of an undamped torsional system. Setup of apparatus First, we need a ruler. Then, we measure the distance of the clamp. Make sure it is 800 mm. Then, we tighten the supported clamp. We need a 6 mm diameter of rod. Then, we install it. To tighten it, we need a special key. Make sure it is tight enough. And the second clamp should be tightly enough. After that, to install the mesh in a supported mesh, we need a screw and take mesh we need. and screw it then put an accelerometer in an accelerometer stand and accelerometer cable we connect it with the data acquisition for USB cable from data acquisition, connect it with laptop. Open NIDAQ Max. Then, choose data neighborhood and create new. Choose NIDAQ Max task and click next. Click the acquire signal and analog input. Choose acceleration as we use accelerometer as our sensor. Choose A0 as we connect the sensor to the A0. Rename the task to group 5. Click finish. Next, Change the sensitivity of the sensor to 106. Then we use continuous samples. Run the program for a while. Click stop and save the program. Now, we can close NIDAQ Max. The next step is to open Daisy Lab. Go to Measurement. Choose Hardware Setup and I DAQ Max and synchronize it to 
configure the system click ok now the system is successfully synchronized Firstly, we measure the length from fire wheel to the arm of wheel. We measure it using a ruler. Then, we get 160 mm of radius. After that, we measure the height of arm wheel to the ground. We get 250 mm of height. Then we add 100 gram of mass to the supported mass. Then then we measure the height of arm wheel after we put a hundred gram mass. The height is recorded in a table. Repeat the experiment until one thousand gram of mass. Again, we measure the height of arm wheel the height is recorded in a table First, we take the steel as indicator and measure the length. We measure the length of the indicator using a ruler. After the length is obtained, we set the point from the supported mass to the steel. Then, Take 100 gram mass and install it to the supported mass. Make sure to install both supported mass. After the both supported mass is installed properly, push the supported mass to the indicator height and wait until the arm will stop. From this video, we can conclude that we must set up all the apparatus properly to achieve proper results. The accelerometer must be connected and synchronized properly. The stiffness of the road from the experiment should be compared with the theoretical value and the decay rate can be found by plotting a long y over dt graph. Thank you.